For those who are interested in watching these reactions early, uncut, and uncensored, I always got a link of my Patreon in the description. Thank you to the patrons who support. What? No, they're doing their. <gasps> no! Oh, they got outplayed. They left their. God, Vegeta charged that up a bit too much. I give props to Super Dragon Ball Heroes because they never failed with the action yet. Every episode is packed. We got Vegito with Kaioken. We got Super Saiyan 4 Vegito. We got Ultra Instinct. With these short episodes, only seven episodes in, it was pretty actually action-packed and I enjoyed it. Now, Goku blew up. I'm gonna make a couple predictions just randomly, just for fun. Prediction number one, Goku is dead. He's dead. He got blown up. But the, all the planets blew up. It's over. Option number two, he somehow tanked it. Like he's gonna be floating in space like uh, unconscious or something option three he instant transmission somewhere i don't know let's see also we met that squad i think few was in the back of it he's leading like a, a few zamasu those are probably also time patrol people that came from different areas let's get to super dragon ball heroes episode seven all right we're back in beerus's area that goku has more drip than the goku we know <laughs> the time patrol one i like his outfit Okay, no, I don't think it's gonna go well here. There they go. They're off. Yo, what? Oh, I thought he was vanishing for a second. Yo, are you good? This man ran is over. He's so tired. Did something happen in Universe 6? It's probably few, bro. This man's jumping around universes starting wars. Alright, wait, calm down. Hold up. It's jumping. <laughs> So Vegeta doesn't care. He's angry. Oh, he's ready to go on a rampage. Yo, we already saw a rampage. There's so much action, and now there's gonna be more battles. Where is this area? Where are we at? Universe 6? Oh, it's hit! Verse this. Alright, so this was happening in Universe 6. Kaba, oh my god, this area is getting destroyed. We got Kalafla and um, Kale. Yo, I'm glad to see these characters fighting again, even though it's not canon. It's lit to see this. He's too fast. These people are different, though, than the ones we've been seeing. We've never seen these enemies. I wonder if they're like working for a few as well. Oh, they're siblings. They look like robots, like androids. Oh, hey, come on, use, this use your time skip on him. Catch him off guard. That was quick. Oh no. Yo, Universe 6 might end. She's casually just 2v1ing them and whooping them. Alright, here comes the time skip. He countered it? Okay. This guy's on another league. He's choking him out. Oh, you didn't see that one coming. He thought he can defeat a hit like that. I mean, some characters sometimes you see in this Super Dragon Ball Heroes thing, the game promotion, you can see some of them are like dumbed down or kind of nerfed. Actually, but at the same time, you can say these enemies are broken and they're just too strong. Taunting her. All right, good shit. They got the upper hand now. Yeah, does it. I thought they were actually gonna get their ass whooped. Tanked it. 
<laughs> that was sort of effective. Who the hell are you guys? Where do you come from? I just noticed this dude Cabo was already out of the fight. He didn't even fight them. It's like he got one shot or something. Oh. He just instantly healed like that? Yeah, I think it's done for them. What the hell was that? How many abilities do these people have? He did the same exact move. Oh, who's that? No way. They made it this quick? Vegeta and Trunks. Universe 7 pulled up. Vegeta's back to being like Kappa's mentor. This is clutch, they really needed them. Before Vegeta said he's gonna go like crazy on him, he's already pissed. Damn, Trunks looks more buff here or something. See, the thing about these two people, I don't know anything about them, but they just seem OP the way they like they self healed. I wonder how many of those type of characters are gonna be in this show. Who's that? That looks like few, but it's not, is it? He has a drippy ass jacket though. The Omni King. Okay, these people are like going after the Omni King. How the hell are they going to defeat the Omni King? They're about to do something new probably that we never seen. Yo, these threats are actually pretty huge. The fact that there's people trying to take down Zeno is insane. And look how fast they're destroying the universe. Was it all done just by these two? Are these the only two that attacked Universe 6 and did all this? What? They just infused into their bodies. They like possessed Kale and Kaifa. Oh shit. Yo, I've seen those lines in um GT. I don't know if this has something to do with GT. Okay, are they just gonna spam that same move? So what was the point of taking over their bodies? I mean, now technically they beat two people. They seem a lot stronger as well. Just beat them. Let's see if it's easy though. It's probably gonna be tough. Can they still use Saiyan abilities while having their bodies? That would be pretty broken. And where the hell's Goku? Is he actually dead? 
I could already tell they were artificial. インプットされているのさ。だけど<笑> They are way faster than those key blasts, bro. Where's he going? Oh, it's still Super Saiyan. I was hoping for blue. Oh yeah, Hit is taking care of one of them and then Trunks is taking care of one of them and he's gonna charge up his final flash. Nice, hold her! Push up together and smack their shit with a final flash! What? No, they're doing their- <gasps> No! Oh, they got outplayed! They left their- God, Vegeta charged that up a bit too much! Yo, that was massive! But they left the bodies as soon as they hit, that's how I'll play. He literally just hit Cuffle and Kale. Oh no! <laughs> that was even scary! That did not go well. They just dodged it. What was that? Some energy dropped their ass all at the same time as this guy. Wait, that's 100% few, right? He just looks different. He got no outfit. Oh no, it's not few. Hearts? This guy seems stronger. Hey, this villain's on the league. This man wants to take over. Like, fully. Hearts is different, bro. Taking down the Omni King. Who has the guts to do that? He's powerful as shit. What is he standing on? What is that? For real, what the hell is he doing? Okay, he just... What is that, cube? Yo! I feel like the scaling of this show is even more than the actual Huh? He just crushed a planet inside a cube? Oh no, he's gonna crush their ass. Yo, this show brought up some broken ass characters. They are way too strong. Oh, he should have known about Zamasu's personality. I guess they're equally, like, working together on the same level to destroy um, Zeno. He reads minds? That's not good. Oh, there's Jiren. Whoa! Tapu got dropped! They got all these people scattered all over the universe. Yo, Grand Priest, can you erase them? Goku. Oh shit, Goku's where? Wait, what is happening? Goku's here the whole time. 
They just keep getting me more and more curious about this show. So this dude, Cumber, is fighting with Jiren and like Tapo. He's on Universe 11, I'm guessing. I don't know if Hearts is leading this entire thing, but it seems like they're all these bad people are all over the universes. This plan is gonna take down the Omni King. I was thinking like, doesn't can't Grand Priest just protect them? They didn't mention that angels can't fight, but is that part of Grand Priest as well? I was actually thinking Goku was dead, but this dude's wearing like that Grand Priest outfit and he's in like, I don't know what the hell he's doing there.